The United States government has finally seized a Boeing 747-300M aircraft that was unlawfully sold by an Iranian-sanctioned organization to Venezuela. The sale was said to have violated American export control laws. Let's look at the aircraft's history and its future for today's video. Bearing registration Yankee Victor 3531, that aircraft has had a checkered past. The aircraft had been detained by Argentina law enforcement since June 2022, and finally, earlier this year, US officials moved to take possession, with the custody of the aircraft transferred to the United States on Sunday, February 11th. The jumbo jet touched down in Florida on February 12th and will be disposed of. The aircraft was initially under the care of Mahan Air, which US sanctions have restricted for years. The Iranian carrier had allegedly been providing support for the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps. The airline then transferred the aircraft to Emtrashur, a Venezuelan cargo carrier. However, this is another organization that the US currently sanctions. US officials have stated that without US government authorization, the movement of this aircraft violated its export control laws and, in return, benefited Iran's Revolutionary Guard. The Justice Department stated that since it has detained the aircraft, it'll be quote-unquote prepared for disposition. In a statement released by the US Justice Department and reported by ABC, the head of the department's National Security Division, Assistant Attorney General Matthew Olson, stated, The Justice Department is committed to ensuring that the full force of U.S. laws denies hostile state actors the means to engage in malign activities that threaten our national security. Venezuela has kicked back, noting that the seizure was a, quote, shameful, rapacious operation. It has vowed to challenge the situation, saying that it'll, quote, take all actions to restore justice and achieve the restitution of the aircraft to its legitimate owner. However, further instructions on their plan have yet to be made public. The presidential administration of Venezuela has now also accused the US and Argentinian governments of violating civil aeronautics regulations and the political, polite, and commercial rights of the Venezuelan carrier Emtrashore. Yankee Victor 3531 with MSN 23413 first took flight in January 1986 and was delivered to French airline Union de Transport Aérien, or UTA, flying with the airline until 1992 before being transferred to Air France. It was then stored from 2006. Mahan Air took control of the aircraft in 2007 and then transferred it to Emtrashore in February 2022. What do you think of this 747 seizure? Let us know by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.